June yeah. is, <laughs> sorry. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> June is Pride Month, and it's to honor the Stonewall Riots in Manhattan, which was the tipping point for the gay rights movement here in the U.S. Now, 50 years later, the U.S. still recognizes Pride Month. News 4 Tucson's Kendra Hall joins us in studio once again to see how it's being celebrated here in Tucson. Kendra. Yeah, I talked with LGBT organizations in Tucson who say the community is overall pretty accepting, but there's still a lot of work to be done. Yes, we've made tons of progress, amazing progress through lives lost, through trials, tribulations but we still have a lot of work to go. Sam Cloud with Tucson Pride says this month is to shine a light on the LGBT community. Our role uh, in the community is really to help educate the community as a whole on the LGBT community, as well as our rights, acceptance, uh, and one of our missions is really to kind of unify the community. According to a national survey by the Williams Institute, 40% of America's homeless youth identify as LGBT. Tucson offers many resources for LGBT youth. I got an email from someone from um, Protective uh, Services um, saying that a youth had been kicked out, um, identifying as transgender. Their family refused to, to call her by the name she wanted to be called and, and told her that she couldn't come back until she went to uh, conversion therapy. Travis Craddock works for the Southern Arizona AIDS Foundation. About a year ago, they opened the Thornhill Lopez Center on 4th Ave, which is a safe place for LGBT youth. It's designed to be a safe space for LGBTQ plus and allied youth uh, to come and find resources, programming, um, again, to make sure that they're leading happy and healthy lives. So our programming here is centered around, um, you know, um, HIV prevention, of course, uh, but also healthy sex practices, um, substance abuse prevention, suicide prevention, which we know is, is a huge problem uh, for people who are LGBTQ, especially at such a young age. And there are many other resources available in Tucson. You can find links on our website, that's kvoa.com.